What's going on guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Ray's Docs and the SDK for Operation Harsh Doorstop has officially been launched in the Epic Game Store. Now, if you guys don't know what this is, it is the software development kit, pretty much that's gonna allow you to mod this game in the way that you want to. It's gonna give you a plethora of libraries, giving you all of the assets that were used in the core game itself for you to develop your own mods to make this game even better. And just like the game itself is planned to be completely free once it hits early access, this SDK is also available to you completely free. So this is huge, huge for people into gaming, huge for the tactical community because they're gonna have this tool available for them to use at any time and they can start right now. With that being said, the main purpose behind this video is to show you how to download the SDK directly from the Epic Game Store and how to begin your very first project. Now please keep in mind I am not a modder by any way shape or form. I am simply going to provide this video for you guys to get started right now. So without further ado, if you enjoyed this video or find it useful, please make sure to like and subscribe to the channel. I will be keeping up with Operation Harsh Doorstop so make sure you guys don't miss out. Alright, so let's go ahead and get started. In the description box, I left you a direct link so that you guys can download the SDK. Or if you want to search for it in the Epic Game Store, I'm going to show you what you need to put in so that you can find it. And then we're going to go ahead and download it onto our PC. Alright, so first things first, you guys are going to need an Epic Games account. So go to epicgames.com. I'm going to leave this link in the description box. You guys click through it. Go ahead up to the top right and hit sign in. And obviously you don't have an account so you can't choose any of these but at the very bottom you're going to see it says sign up. Go ahead and click on that and then choose what method you want to do that. So if you want to create a direct email with Epics, you can do that. If you want to use your Facebook, Xbox, whichever you choose, it's up to you. So once you do that and you download the launcher, it's going to appear on your desktop and you're going to want to open that. All right, once this has opened up, this is where you want to be. Obviously, if you haven't signed in, just sign in. That way you guys can have access to the search bar and everything. So you're going to go to the store option here on the tab on the left. Once you're under the store, you're going to go up to the top right and you're going to hit search. All right, so once you're in the search box, what you're going to type in is OHD core. All right, and just click on it. It's going to appear for you. And there you go. This is the SDK for Operation Harsh Doorstop. This is the only place where you can download this, so make sure you guys are downloading the correct thing. I don't want you guys to get any kind of viruses on your computer, so make sure you guys pay attention and click the link that I provided for you or find it in the actual store the way I just showed you. So, all right, it's going to give you all the information you need to know, what it's all about. It's going to also, if you scroll down, it's going to tell you the PC specification that you're going to need or what they recommend for you to be able to run this and actually have a good experience. So make sure you guys check that out before you waste your time um, doing any of this, all right? So you're gonna need at least 150 gigabytes of space available to make this download possible. So make sure you guys free up some space, that way you guys can get on your way, all right? So we're gonna go ahead and install it on my PC. So you're gonna hit get. All right, and obviously it's completely free. It's in my library now. So we're gonna go to the library and you should see that it appears here and it's ready to be installed. So what you wanna do is actually hit the install on the bottom, find out where you want to store this on your PC. So we're gonna go ahead and store it on my actual hard drive here. All right, we'll go ahead and install. And it's gonna create a shortcut for you so you guys can find it, all right. Now, once this download has completed, I'll come back and show you what to do to get started on your first mod. Obviously, guys, like I said, I'm not a modder, so I'm not going to show you any in-depth stuff, any extra tools or stuff that you could use. I'm just going to show you how to begin your first project and just jump right in. So this is going to take a while. Um, it is 150 gigabytes of storage that you need. So once this is done, I'll go ahead and come back and show you what else to do. All right, so as you guys can see, my download has officially completed. If I wanted to launch it from the Epic Games launcher, I can do that right here. But instead of doing that, I'm just going to show you how to do it through your desktop. Um, pretty much, I'm going to go ahead and X out of this. You're going to have a folder appear on your desktop. It's going to have OHD Core Mod Kit on the name. So go ahead and open that up. 
All right, and one thing to keep in mind is that you guys do not need to download Unreal Engine 4 for this to work. So this package already has everything that you need. Unreal 4 Engine is already in this folder that you downloaded, so you're ready to go as soon as you open it up. Now, like I said earlier, guys, I am not a modder in any kind of way, so I wouldn't be able to explain any of this to you, but I'm sure there's a plethora of videos out there that you guys can look up and learn how to mod and do everything that you need to do but if you guys want a basics of it pretty much you can go up to the top right here you'll see this hat and you can go through all these tutorials and uh, basics blueprints editor the code animation all that just go through these basic tutorials and you'll be able to find what you need I'm pretty sure if you go into the discord community and go to the modding section you guys can get any kind of help that you want so make sure you guys are in that discord server but besides that, if you want to start your own layer or your own level, just go up to file here on the top left. You can create a new level. You can uh, go to an existing project, open up things that you need, any other assets that you have from other um, builders. And then you can go down here. You can also create your own projects. So it's, it's sky's the limit, guys, with what you could do with this uh, with this kit or inside Unreal Engine 4. So you guys explore, you guys do all that stuff. Um, I'm just simply gonna show you how to get here and there you are. So also if you guys are working on a level inside of this, uh, this diagram here or this little area of the window, just go ahead and hit play up here. And if you guys wanna test these things out or just move around the, uh, the area that you've created, you can just hit play up there and you guys will spawn in just like if you were playing a real game you can just deploy obviously there's not a map but i'm sure you guys can work around and get that map activated so that you can go around and test everything that you've built up so you can do that directly in here you do not need to download the actual game you don't have to be a patreon uh, supporter or anything you don't have to wait for the game to be launched on steam for you to have access to this right here. So I have read and have heard that you can play the entire game pretty much from this builder right here. So you guys got to find that out. If you want me to make a video on it, I can do it for you. But that's pretty much it, guys. I wanted to show you how to get to it. I'm showing you and that's it. So if you found this video useful, make sure you guys like and subscribe to the channel. I will provide more guides for Operation Harsh Doorstop that you guys might find useful. So make sure you don't miss out on that. Also, I cover other tactical games, other open world realistic games that you might be interested in. So without further ado, guys, I appreciate you watching and I'll see you on the next video.